नमस्ते विद्यार्थी मित्रों एम एस टी सी टी मैथमेटिक्स पार्ट टू डिफरशिएशन चैप्टर वी यूर्वी तीन वीडियो अपलोड के देखी तुम्हें बढ़ू शकता है आज के वीडियो मध्य मी पंच एक्जाम्पल घेना डिफरशिएशन या चैप्टर वर मी तीन से एक्जाम्पल घेना रोज मजा एक वीडियो तुम्हारा तो बढ़ा चला तो आज का वीडियो अपन सुरू करू फर्स्ट एक्साम्पल इफ वाईज इक्वल टू टेन इन वर्स इन ब्रैकेट रूट एक्स प्लस रूट एक्स अपॉन वन माइनस इन रूट ऑफ एक्स देन डीवाई बाय डीएक्स इज इक्वल टू वेरी इजी एग्जाम्पल इधर टेन इन वर्स ऑफ ए प्लस बी अपॉन वन माइनस ए इन टू बी चाहिए फॉर्मुला अपन अप्लाई करना तो इधर टेन इन वर्स ऑफ इन ब्रैकेट क्या अपना करें अपन तो फॉर्मूला ही लूँ शक्ति टैन इन्वर्स ऑफ इन ब्रैकेट एक्स प्लस और माइनस वाई वन माइनस और प्लस एक्स इनटू वाई एंड दैट इज इक्वल्स टू टैन इन्वर्स ऑफ एक्स प्लस और माइनस टैन इन्वर्स ऑफ वाई या फॉर्मूले नुसार यू विल गेट टैन इन्वर्स ऑफ रूट एक्स प्लस टैन इन्वर्स ऑफ रूट ऑफ ए नाउ डिफरेंशिएट दिस विथ रिस्पेक्ट टू एक्स देयर फॉर डी वाई बाय डी एक्स इज इक्वल्स टू डी डी एक्स ऑफ टैन इन्वर्स ऑफ रूट एक्स प्लस टैन इन्वर्स ऑफ रूट ऑफ ए द डेरिवेटिव ऑफ टैन इन्वर्स ऑफ रूट ऑफ ए व्हिच इज अ कांस्टेंट क्वांटिटी इट्स अ डेरिवेटिव जीरो टैन इन्वर्स ऑफ रूट एक्स मींस व्हाट 1 अपॉन टैन इन्वर्स ऑफ एक्स द डेरिवेटिव 1 अपॉन 1 प्लस एक्स वर्स तो तसंच इथे रूट एक्स असल्यामुळे 1 upon 1 plus root of x bracket square into d dx of root x. Root x are derivative 1 upon 2 times root x and therefore you will get 1 upon 2 root x in bracket 1 plus x. Okay. And therefore the option d is a correct one. D option ya tika ni kasa yata to correct x. Sada formula ya tika ni wapar de lai. Next example. Y is equals to tan inverse in bracket 5x upon 1 minus 6x square. Then find dy by dx. So if the 5x say 5x can be written as 2x plus 3x. Therefore, y is equals to tan inverse in bracket 2x plus 3x upon 1 minus 2x into 3x. Then you will get by using the formula tan inverse of 2x plus tan inverse of 3x. Now differentiate this with respect to x. Therefore, dy by dx is equals to d dx of tan inverse of 2x plus tan inverse of 3x. Tan inverse of 2x are derivative 1 upon 1 plus 2x bracket square into d dx of 2x plus 1 upon 1 plus 3x bracket square into d dx of 3x. Okay. Derivative of 2x is 2 and you will get the answer that is 2 upon 1 plus 4x square plus 3 upon 1 plus 9x square. And hence the option C is a correct one. Next example. If y is equals to cot inverse in bracket 1 minus in bracket x plus 3 into x plus 4 upon 2x plus 7. Then find dy by dx. That is cot inverse zilla. Yeah, cot sir, by using the formula cot inverse of 1 upon x means what tan inverse of x. I the formula apply kela. Therefore, we can write here tan inverse of. A 2x plus 7. Manjit sky x plus 3 plus x plus 4. And next term 1 minus in bracket x plus 3 into x plus 4. A as it is apne pe kele. And this is nothing but the tan inverse of A plus B upon 1 minus A into B. Then for, therefore you will get tan inverse of X plus 3 plus tan inverse of X plus 4. And that's a derivative is here too. That is dy by dx is equals to 1 upon 1 plus X plus 3 bracket square plus 1 upon 1 plus X plus 4 bracket square. This is dy by dx. And hence the option D is a correct one. Next example. If y is equals to tan inverse in bracket 5x plus 1 upon 3 minus x minus 6x x square, then dy by dx is equals to. Okay. Yeah, take an answer upon us observe 5x plus 1 can be written as it's written as like this 3x plus 2 plus 2x minus 1. But what about the denominator? 
minus x minus 6x square okay next upon kai karna ite ya sarva term madha minus sign common karna then in bracket you will get 6x square plus x minus 2 okay 6x square minus 2 then you will get 12x square but 12 sati kai ta tyaje factors kite ana ta 4x minus 3x okay Therefore, here 1 in bracket 6x square 6x square plus 4x okay plus 4x minus 3x minus 2 next 1 at the factors kernel yeah though that the common in the 2x common in therefore in bracket you will get here 2x in bracket 3x plus 2 take minus sign as a common then in bracket you will get here 3x plus 2 okay now the next 1 minus next in bracket you will get 3x plus 2 and the remaining terms are 2x minus 1 one yeah check factors karta na apne lakas check factors one minus in bracket 3x plus 2 in the next bracket 2x minus 3 upon ya prakare to denominator ithe tayar karat asto ani yacha sarkas manantar numerator ghet asto that is a 3x plus 2 plus 2x minus 1 hence ya examples madhe main main idea ita chatli okay and therefore next ha nemi cha apla formula dale that is a tan inverse of a plus b upon 1 minus a into b then differentiate this then you will get dy by dx is equals to 1 upon 3x plus 2, 1 upon 1 plus 3x plus 2 bracket square into derivative of 3x plus 2, which is a 3, okay, plus tan inverse of 2x minus 1, again 1 upon 1 plus 2x minus 1 bracket square into derivative of 2x minus 1, which is a 2. Normal simplification, therefore you get the option A is a correct one. Next example. If y is equals to sine of 2 times tan inverse of in root of 1 minus x upon 1 plus x, then dy by dx is equals to, okay. Now see this here, dy is equals to sine of in bracket 2 tan inverse in bracket 1 minus x upon 1 plus x. Put x is equals to cos theta. x is equals to cos theta is upon it is up to 1 minus cos theta upon 1 plus cos theta. 1 minus cos theta means what? 2 sin square theta by 2. 1 plus cos theta means what? 2 cos square theta by 2. 2 to get cancelled here. You will get tan square theta by 2. Okay. And root of tan square theta by 2. That's nothing but the tan of theta by 2. That is a 2 tan inverse of tan of theta by 2. That is nothing but 2 into theta by 2. Okay. This 2 to get cancelled. Then you will get y is equals to sin theta. But next in sin theta is nothing but in root of 1 minus cos square theta. But what is the cos theta? Cos theta manja factor x. Therefore, you will get in root of 1 minus x square. Therefore, y is equals to in root of 1 minus x square. But that's a derivative. Find out dy by dx. That is a dy by dx is equals to ddx of in root of 1 upon 2 in root of 1 minus x square. Okay. Into ddx of 1 minus x square, which is a minus 2x. Therefore, the answer is a minus x upon i the 2 to kind of the cut on minus x upon in root of 1 minus x square and hence the option c is a correct one a fast one to me go shak tai we serve steps to malaya details made sangit lene next if y is equals to tan inverse of in bracket x upon 1 plus in root of 1 minus x square then find dy by dx this serve substitution chi example set that term is to malatya proper substitutions might be budget. Put x is equals to sin theta. 
and if we substitute here x is equals to sin theta sir upon the amode substitute gala then you will get here first y is equal therefore theta is equals to sin inverse of x ma apla expression kasa tayar hona that is y is equals to tan inverse in bracket x means what sin theta therefore here you will get sin theta upon 1 plus in root of 1 minus sin square theta okay therefore you will get here tan inverse of sin theta means what 2 sin theta by 2 into cos theta by 2 therefore i will write here 2 times sin theta by 2 into cos of theta by 2 next okay 1 minus sin square theta manje kay the cos square theta cos square theta and that's a root get cancel then you will get 1 plus cos theta you think it will be tumala 1 plus cos theta but again what is the 1 plus cos theta that is a 2 cos square theta by 2 therefore here you will get tan inverse of 2 times sin theta by 2 into cos of theta by 2 upon 1 plus cos theta means what 2 cos square theta by 2 so that is 2 2 get cancel a k cos cos kai na that is going to cancel na. therefore you will get here tan inverse of in bracket okay, tan of theta by 2 Okay, tan inverse of tan of theta by 2 means what? You will get theta by 2. But what is the theta? Theta is a sin inverse of x. I will write here sin inverse of x. Y is equals to sin inverse of x. What should the derivative? Derivative of sin inverse of x is a 1 upon in root of 1 minus x square. And hence the option 1 upon 2 times in root of 1 minus x square is the correct one. Now the next question if y is equals to sin inverse of x plus in root of 1 minus x square sin inverse of in root of 1 minus x square then find dy by dx easy question but yes that you have formula to mala lakshat to nagar sin inverse of x is equals to cos inverse of in root of 1 minus x square manja ka ki sin inverse of x value kai substitute karna apan cos inverse of in root of 1 minus x square therefore you will get here y is equals to sin inverse of in root of 1 minus x square plus cos inverse of in root of 1 minus x square yeah sin inverse yeah i wish you have to do like cos inverse of in root of 1 minus x square now here sin inverse of theta plus cos inverse of theta that is nothing but the pi by 2 and therefore y is equals to pi by 2 now differentiate this with respect to x, this is the constant term, and hence its a derivative is a zero. Next, Kai Lakshya tells us sine inverse of theta plus cos inverse of theta, and that is equals to pi by two, and hence its a derivative is a zero. Therefore, the option A is a correct one. Now, next question: Y is equals to sine inverse of in bracket five into sin th sin x plus 4 into cos x upon in root of 41 then find dy by dx yeah type of for example say y is equals to sin inverse of 5 upon root of 41 manja apan ite separate karto into sin x plus 4 upon root of 41 into cos x nantar ite substitute karto apan ite bahir sin inverse asle amule aad dekhil sin inverse Sines, sin of a plus b is the expansion of lela yati kandida ko is the therefore 5 upon in root of 41 is equals to cos a and 4 upon in root of 41 is equals to sin a and tan of a is equals to 4 by 5 therefore a is equals to tan inverse of 4 by 5 therefore y is equals to sin inverse of in bracket kude kai kai linar cos of a into sin x plus sin of a into cos x therefore y is equals to sin inverse of now here the sin of x cos a plus sin of a into cos x. 
This is the expansion of sine of a plus b. Therefore, sine of x plus a. Sine inverse of sine of x plus a is equals to x plus a. Therefore, you will get y is equals to x plus a. Now, differentiate this with respect to x. The derivative of x is 1 and a is a constant. It's a derivative 0. And hence, the option b is a correct one. b option is correct. Now, the next question. Now, next question. If y is equals to cos inverse of in bracket root 3 cos of x by 2 plus sin of x by 2 upon 2 then dy by dx is equals to. Okay. Now, this is the problem problem for Pramanit to solve. That is here you will get y is equals to cos inverse. Okay. Root 3 by 2 separate kernel upon 2. Root 3 by 2 into cos of in bracket x by 2 plus 1 upon 2 sin of in bracket x by 2 bracket complete. At the while cos inverse, manja add the kill apella cos the expansion karnas up and to praise the gunner. This root 3 by 2 if term could look at happen day root 3 by 2 and this is nothing but the cos of cos of pi by 6 cos of x by 2 plus next is a sin of pi by 6 and sin of x by 2 okay. and therefore y is equals to cos inverse of in bracket cos of cos of x by 2 minus pi by 6. Now cos inverse of Cos of x by 2 minus pi by 6 is nothing but x by 2 minus pi by 6 and this is y is equals to. Now differentiate this with respect to x. Derivative of x is 1 and therefore you will get here dy by dx is equals to 1 upon 2. Okay. dy by dx is equals to 1 upon 2 and hence the option c is a correct one. The next example, if y is equals to sin inverse in bracket 5x plus 12 in root of 1 minus x square upon 13, then find dy by dx. Now we have put x is equals to sin theta. Ya thikani apan substitute karna. Okay. Ani ya thikani dekhin kuna tasa saplela. X is equals to sin theta. Then what is the value of in root of? in root of 1 minus x square and that is equals to cos of theta. Next y is equals to y is equals to sin inverse of in bracket. Okay. Pi upon 13. Here is a pi upon 13 into x. x means what? It's a sin theta plus 12 upon 13 and here again 1 minus in root of 1 minus x square means what? It's a cos theta. Next up on it, a substitute karada so by sin inverse a add the kill sin such expansion as the by j already the sin theta alilai. Therefore, we substitute here that is a cos of a is equals to cos of a is equals to kitena that y y 13 and sin of a is equals to 12 upon 13 and therefore y is equals to sin inverse of sin inverse of what is here cos of a into sin theta plus sin of a into cos theta okay and therefore y is equals to 
sin inverse of in bracket sin of theta plus c and that is equals to theta plus a. Therefore, y is equals to what is the theta? Put uh, x is equals to sin theta. Therefore, theta is equals to sin inverse of x plus a. Now differentiate this with respect to x, and therefore the derivative of sin inverse of x is the one upon in under root of one minus x square. And derivative of a is 0. Therefore, you will get here dy by dx. Take the dy by dx. dy upon dx. The derivative of sin inverse of x is in root of 1 minus x square. And the derivative of a is 0. And we fast cartel up there. Number of the examples are in the identity. Okay. Therefore, the option A is the correct one. Now, the next example. If y is equal to sin inverse, so in bracket, in root of 1 plus x plus in root of 1 minus x upon 2, then dy by dx is equal to. Now, put here x is equal to cos theta and theta is equal to cos inverse of x. What is the value of in root of 1 plus x? That is the 1 in root of 1 plus cos theta is equal to root 2. So, theta by 2. In root of 1 minus x means what? In root of 1 minus cos theta means what? 1 minus cos theta means what? 2 sin square theta by 2. One is the root 2 and root. Okay. Root 2 sin of theta by 2. Square and root get cancelled. Therefore, y is equal to sin inverse of. Okay. Uh, what are the values? In root of 1 plus x means what? Root 2 cos of theta by 2. Root 2 sin of theta by 2 divided by 2. Root 2 upon 2. Then you will get 1 upon root 2 of theta by 2 again 1 upon root 2 sin of theta by 2 1 by root 2 means what sin of pi by 4 1 by root 2 cos of pi by 4 this is the expansion of sin of pi by 4 plus theta by 2 sin inverse of sin of pi by 4 plus theta by 2 is nothing but pi by 4 plus theta by 2 but what is the theta theta is the cos inverse of x and therefore you will get y is equals to pi by 4 plus 1 by uh, 2 cos inverse of x the derivative of pi by 4 is 0, cos inverse of x is a minus, it's a derivative is a minus 1 upon in root of 1 minus x square and hence dy by dx is equal to minus 1 upon 2 in root of 1 minus x square and hence the option C is a correct one. Now the next example, if y is equal to sec of cos inverse of 8 upon x then dy by dx. Okay. Cos inverse of 8 upon x is nothing but the sec inverse of x upon 8. Sec of sec inverse of x upon 8 is nothing but x upon 8. That is the sec of sec inverse of theta is a theta. Similarly, here y is equals to you will get x upon 8. Now differentiate this with respect to x. Then derivative of x is 1. Therefore, you will get divided by x is equals to 1 upon 8. And hence the option B is a correct one. Next example. If y is equals to sec of in bracket tan inverse of x then dy by dx is equals to. So, you have to say, bahar ka sa hai sec ya tan e. Mungi aapne lehte change kara vangna re. Put x is equals to tan theta first of all and theta is equals to tan inverse of x. Put x is equals to tan theta. Therefore, theta is equals to tan inverse of x. What is the sec square theta? Sec square theta means what? 1 plus tan square theta. And that is tan theta means what? x. Therefore, you will get sec square theta is equals to 1 plus x square. Again, sec square theta is equals to 1 plus x square. Therefore, sec theta is equals to in the root of 1 plus x square. And hence, lastly, theta is equals to sec inverse of in the root of 1 plus x square. Hey, important it is charge step here. Theta chi value upon it is sec inverse of in root of 1 plus x square. Okay. Next, x is equal to tan theta. Therefore, theta is equal to tan inverse of x. Manje ya tan inverse of x shatika ne aata kaya subtract karna aapan theta subtract karna. Therefore, you will get y is equal to sec theta. But what is the theta? Theta is a sec inverse of 
in root of 1 plus x square. Now sec of in bracket sec inverse of in root of 1 plus x square means what sec of in bracket sec inverse of theta that is theta. Similar here you will get y is equals to in root of 1 plus x square and that's a derivative that is 1 upon 2 times in root of 1 plus x square into d dx of 1 plus x square which is the 2x and you will get the answer x upon in root of 1 plus x square. When you have any substitution he very important is that is x is equals to tan theta and it is the same as the x server to at the upper and the sec inverse may happen to translate the first time. Okay. That's the thing. Option B is a correct one. Next example. If y is equals to tan inverse of in bracket 1 minus sin x upon cos x, then dy by dx is equals to. Now see this here. 1 minus x. Sorry. 1 minus sin x upon cos x. 1 minus sin x manja kai. The cos of x by 2 minus sin of x by 2 bracket square. Manja kai. Ha 1 manja kai. The cos square x by 2 plus sin square x by 2. And sin of x manja kai. 2 sin x by 2 into cos x by 2. And therefore, you will get here cos square x by 2 plus sin square x by 2 have 1 sati. And sin x sati kai the minus 2 sin x by 2 into cos x by 2. That is nothing but the cos of x by 2 minus sin x by 2 bracket square. Okay. And what about the cos x? Ma cos x sati kai apply la formula by the cos of 2 times theta means what? Cos square theta minus sin square theta. Similarly, cos x means what? Cos square x by 2 minus sin square x by 2. Okay. Adi, cos of x by 2 minus sin of x by 2 bracket square and it is cos square x by 2 minus sin square x by 2 then minus minus terms numerator denominator on the, the cut with that and then therefore you will get cos of x by 2 minus sin x by 2 upon cos of x by 2 plus sin of x by 2 divide numerator and denominator by the cos of x by 2 therefore you will get 1 minus tan of x by 2 upon 1 plus tan of x by 2 and this is nothing but the expansion of tan of pi by 4 minus x by 2 and therefore here you will get y is equals to at the end of y is equals to get him on y is equals to tan inverse of in bracket tan of pi by 4 pi by 4 minus x by 2 bracket complete and hence y is equals to pi by 4 minus x by 2. Now differentiate this with respect to x. The derivative of pi by 4 is 0, x is 1. Therefore, y is equals to minus 1 upon 2. Therefore, the option C is a correct one. Next example. If y is equals to sec inverse in bracket 1 plus x upon 2 root x. Then divide by dx is equals to. But as x inverse upon cos method transfer kele like cos inverse of 2 root x upon 1 plus x. Substantially important eh? root of x is equals to tan theta. Therefore, theta is equals to tan inverse of root x. Therefore, y is equals to cos inverse of 2 times tan theta upon 1 plus tan square theta. And you have formula say that is a 2 tan theta upon 1 plus tan square theta is nothing but the sine of 2 times theta. Therefore, cos inverse of sin of 2 times theta. When I sin of 2 times theta is upon cos mode transfer karna. And that is nothing but the cos inverse of cos of pi by 2 minus 2 times theta. If I sign up and consider color for a z, that is here minus here you get y is equals to cos inverse of cos of pi by 2 minus 2 theta. That is nothing but the pi by 2 minus 2 theta. Here is a pi by 2. What is a theta? Theta is a tan inverse of root x. Therefore, dy by dx is equals to d dx of pi by 2 minus 2 tan inverse of root x. Tan inverse of root x the derivative. Okay. So, derivative is easy. Derivative of pi by 2 is 0 or 2 as it is. It's a tan inverse of root x the derivative. 1 upon 1 plus root x. It's a square plus d dx of root x. What is the derivative of root x? 1 upon 2 times root x. Here 2 to get cancelled and you will get minus 1 upon root x in bracket 1 plus x and hence this is the dy by dx therefore the option b is a correct one b option yeah to correct one
Now the next example. If y is equals to tan inverse of in bracket 1 plus x tan x upon x minus tan x then dy by dx is equals to. Now we have y is equals to tan inverse in bracket 1 plus x tan x upon x minus tan x divide numerator and denominator by x. Ka ke apne lite 1 by just to put thing par. Therefore we divide it numerator denominator by x then for you will get tan inverse of in bracket 1 upon x plus tan x upon 1 minus a 1 upon x into tan x. Now this is the expansion of tan inverse of 1 upon x plus tan inverse of tan x. Now tan inverse of 1 upon x is nothing but the cot inverse of x and tan inverse of tan of x is x and therefore dy by dx is equals to ddx of cot inverse of x. What is the derivative of cot inverse of x? That is a minus 1 upon 1 plus x square and the derivative of x is a 1 and therefore if you simplify this then you get minus 1 plus 1 plus x square upon 1 plus x square plus 1 minus 1 get cancelled and hence you will get dy by dx is equals to x square upon 1 plus x square and hence the option A is a correct one. Question number 17. If f of x is equals to cot inverse of x raised to x minus x raised to minus x upon 2 then find f dash of 1. Okay. Now see this here f of x is equals to cot inverse of x raised to x minus x raised to minus x upon 2. That is simplification that is this cot inverse of x raised to x minus x raised to minus x upon 2 is written as tan inverse of 2 upon x raised to x minus x raised to minus x means what 1 upon x raised to x. When I simplification curve upon x raised to x ne x raised to x la multiplied gala. Then you will get x raised to x bracket square minus 1 upon x raised to x. So multiply and reciprocal on your side. Therefore you will get tan inverse of 2 x raised to x upon x raised to x bracket square minus 1. Now put here x raised to x is equals to tan theta. Therefore theta is equals to tan inverse of x raised to x. Therefore f of x is equals to tan inverse of 2 times tan theta upon tan square theta minus 1. And this is the expansion of tan of 2 times theta. Pantyasa tablet minus n common kadavilla. Therefore, we will take minus n common first of all, then 2 times tan theta upon 1 minus tan square theta. Therefore, you will get this is the expansion of tan of 2 times theta. Pantyawa, minus n upon the common kadavilla. Therefore, tan inverse of minus in bracket tan of 2 times theta. Again, next, minus tan of 2 times theta is nothing but the tan of minus 2 theta when I take a formula upon apply the like just a sign of minus theta is minus sin theta similarly tan of minus theta is a minus tan theta and therefore minus tan of 2 times theta is a tan of minus 2 theta therefore tan inverse of tan of minus 2 theta is a minus 2 theta okay substitute the value of theta now here okay so the article upon the Theta chi value substitute kana theta is equals to tan inverse of x raised to x. Therefore, f of x is equals to minus 2 tan inverse of x raised to x, f dash of x minus 2 into 1 upon 1 plus x raised to x bracket square into ddx of x raised to x. At the derivative of x raised to x ha par famous problem hai. Hey, tumala to derivative of x raised to x multiply. It's a derivative of x raised to x in bracket 1 plus log of x. Ya puri cha. Examples made up and they keep hard derivative find out. Okay, at a put in simplification to enter minus 2 upon 1 plus x raised to x bracket square into x raised to x in bracket 1 plus log of x. Put a guy find out carriage up. We want to find out f dash of 1 find out carriage. Replace x by 1. We have to x by 1 partner upon minus 2 upon 1 plus 1 x by 1 that is 1 raised to 1. 1 plus log of 1 which is a 0 and hence you will get f dash of 1 is equals to minus 2 upon 1 plus 1 and overall you will get f dash of 1 is a minus 1 okay and hence the option a is a correct one next question if y is equals to tan inverse of in bracket x minus in root of 1 minus x square upon x plus in root of 1 minus x square then dy by dx is equals to okay see that next is a tan inverse y is equals to first of all 
okay, tan inverse in bracket x minus in root of 1 minus x square upon x plus in root of 1 minus x square. Put x is equals to sin theta. Therefore, y is equals to tan inverse sin theta minus in root of 1 minus sin square. Okay, sin square y. Sorry, sin square theta upon sin theta plus in root of 1 minus again here sin square theta. Okay. Therefore, tan inverse of this is sin theta. 1 minus sin square theta means what? Cos theta. Here is a sin theta plus in root of 1 minus sin square theta again the cos square theta. That is a root kind of cos theta. Okay. Divided numerator and the denominator by here cos theta. Therefore, you will get tan theta minus 1 up upon tan theta plus 1. Now, this is the expansion of tan of theta minus pi by 4. Tan inverse of tan of theta minus pi by 4 is nothing but theta minus pi by 4. But what is a theta? Theta is equals to sine inverse of x. Okay, can we write up there? Theta is equals to sine inverse of x. And therefore, y is equals to sine inverse of x minus pi by 4. Now, differentiate this with respect to x. What is the derivative of sine inverse of x? The derivative of sine inverse of x is a 1 upon in under root of 1 minus x square. Therefore, the option B is the correct one. Okay. Now, the next question. Question number 19. DDX of tan inverse of 4 root x upon 1 minus 4x. Okay. Now, here y is equals to tan inverse of 4 root x upon 1 minus 4x. Put 2 root x is equals to tan theta. Y is equals to tan inverse of 2 times tan theta upon 1 minus tan square theta. Now, this is the expansion of tan of 2 times theta. Therefore, tan inverse of tan of 2 times theta is nothing but 2 theta. Therefore, 2 times tan inverse of 2 root x. Okay. 2 root x is equal to tan theta. Therefore, theta is equal to theta. Here, I will write here. This theta is equal to tan inverse of 2 root x. Okay. And hence here, you will get here, uh, that is y is equal to 2 times tan inverse of 2 root x. Therefore, dy by dx is equal to 2 upon 1 plus 2 root x bracket square into d dx of 2 root x. Okay. My answer kai karna the square karna. That is the 2 upon 1 plus 2 root x a square ki tiyala the 4x. d dx of 2 root x. Root x a derivative ki the 1 upon 2 times root x again this 2 2 will get cancelled and hence you will get 2 upon root x in bracket 1 plus 4x and hence the option b is a correct one next example if y is equals to cot inverse of in bracket 1 plus sin x plus in root of 1 minus sin x upon in root of 1 plus sin x minus in root of 1 minus sin x then dy by dx is equals to now here y is equals to cot inverse of in root of 1 plus x plus in root of 1 minus sorry in root of 1 plus sin x plus in root of 1 minus sin x upon in root of 1 plus sin x minus in root of 1 minus sin x. Okay. Now here we substitute the value of 1 plus or minus sin theta is equals to in square bracket cos of theta by 2 plus or minus sin of theta by 2 bracket square. Manjai the 1 plus sin x hai 1 plus sin x hai apan kai substitute karna in bracket cos of x by 2 plus sin of x by 2 bracket square. Bracket square and root get cancelled and hence you will get here cos of x by 2 plus sin of x by 2. This is important. Manjai 1 plus sin x means what? Cos of x by 2 plus sin of x by 2. Similarly here in root of 1 minus sin x manjai kai the cos of x by 2 minus sin of x by 2. In root of 1 plus sin x means what? Cos of x by 2 plus sin of x by 2 minus, again here, cos of x by 2 plus sin of x by 2 minus sin, it is by the way, at minus sin operate killer. So, it is the same thing, minus cos of x by 2 plus sin of x by 2. Here, minus sin of x by 2 and plus sin of x by 2 get cancelled. You will get here 2 times cos of x by 2. Denominator la cos of x by 2, cos of x by 2 get cancelled. You will get here 2 times cos of x by 2. Again, 2, 2 get cancelled. Again, here cos of x by 2 upon sin of x by 2, you will get cot of x by 2. 
cot inverse of cot of x by 2 is a x by 2 and hence it's a derivative dy by dx is equals to 1 upon 2 okay yeah you can have formula important what is the formula 1 plus or minus sin theta is equals to in bracket cos of theta by 2 plus or minus sin of theta by 2 bracket square okay. and hence the option a is a correct one next example if y is equals to sin inverse of in bracket x in root of 1 minus x plus root x in bracket in root of 1 minus x square then find dy by dx okay so here you can sin inverse of x in root of 1 minus x plus root x in root of 1 minus x square now see this here y is equals to as it is the term of anything that right now see this here x square plus in root of 1 minus x square that's a bracket square is nothing but 1 that upon here a square killer the square and root get cancelled you will get here plus x square minus x square get cancelled you will get here 1 as 1 next work i say in root of 1 minus x bracket square plus root x bracket square is equals to 1 at the yati gani root x a square kithi alatar x ala yata square get alatar minus x plus 1 or all plus x minus x get cancelled you will get here 1 okay next y is equals to sine inverse of kithi gai li bhai apan sin theta into cos alpha plus cos theta into sin alpha how it is where it is a guy substitution get there that is substitution is sin x sin theta is equals to what is the substitution sin of theta is equals to x and sin of alpha is equals to now see this here the first term x in root of 1 minus x x means what x means sin theta okay it is sin theta as it is up in root of 1 minus x okay now see this here the sin alpha is equals to root x squaring on both side then you will get x is equals to sin square alpha x is equals to sin square alpha tumala yatika nimade Okay, I will write here x is equals to x is equals to sine square alpha. Now what is the value of 1 minus x? 1 minus x means what? 1 minus sine square alpha and that is nothing but the cos square alpha in root of 1 minus x means what in root of cos square alpha and that is nothing but the cos of alpha therefore the value of in root of 1 minus x is cos alpha next root x this root x is nothing but the sin alpha it adds as it is in next root 1 minus x square 1 minus x square means what 1 minus sin square theta means cos square theta that's a root circle that's you will get here a uh, cos of theta okay therefore y is equals to sine inverse of sine theta into cos alpha plus cos theta into sine alpha and this is the expansion of sine of theta plus alpha therefore y is equals to sine inverse of sine of theta plus alpha is nothing but theta plus alpha but what is the theta here theta is a sine inverse of x and alpha is a sine inverse of root x now differentiate this with respect to x therefore the derivative of sine inverse of x is 1 upon in root of 1 minus x square plus derivative of sine of root x is 1 upon in root of 1 minus root x square into ddx of root x which is 1 upon 2 times root x and hence dy by dx is equals to 1 upon in root of 1 minus x square plus 1 upon in root of 1 minus x into 2 root x and hence her root x number this is the root x into root x take a cos root that is x into 1 you will get x x into x you will get x square and hence this is the answer okay. that is a option c is a correct one now the next question ddx of cos inverse of root of cos x okay 
is equation of that is we know the derivative of apply the derivative of the cos inverse of x that is a minus in root of 1 minus x square similar here minus 1 upon root of cos x square means what is the root of cos x and into d dx of root of cos x that is the 1 upon 2 times root of cos x into derivative of cos x which is the minus sin x okay next this minus and minus that will become plus what about the sin x sin x means what is in root of 1 minus cos square x okay therefore here 2 in root of cos x in root of 1 minus cos x okay puna has split up karna that is in root of 1 plus cos x into in root of 1 minus cos x okay at the next time in root of 1 minus cos x is only terms cannot the cut on a 1 upon 2 by in root of 1 plus cos x upon a root of cos x a cut root with the tagna 1 plus cos x upon cos x 1 upon cos x plus cos x upon cos x you will get 1 1 upon cos x means what sec x therefore 1 upon 2 in root of 1 plus sec x therefore be here the option a is a correct one is the question at all now the next ddx of tan inverse of root x in bracket 3 minus x upon 1 minus 3x okay therefore here the substitution root of x is equals to tan theta okay substitute here that is y is equals to tan inverse of tan theta in bracket 3 minus root of x is equals to tan theta therefore x is equals to tan square theta therefore you will get here tan square theta upon 1 minus 3 tan square theta okay if you multiplication cannot three, 3 times tan theta minus tan cube theta therefore tan inverse of tan of 3 theta tan inverse of tan of 3 theta is a 3 theta that is a 3 into tan inverse of root x and in normal derivative tan inverse of x is a 1 upon 1 plus x square x plus 2 it is root x therefore you will get here that is a 3 upon 1 plus root of x it's a square into ddx of root of x which is a 1 upon 2 times root x okay and then hence the option d is a correct one next question if in bracket a minus b tan y the next bracket a plus b tan x is equals to a square plus b square then dy by dx is equals to okay now in bracket a minus b tan y into a plus b tan x is equals to a square plus b square therefore a minus b tan y is equals to a square plus b square upon a plus b tan x therefore here b tan y is equals to we term up on your side line and you can have a minus one therefore b tan y is equals to a minus a square plus b square upon a plus b tan x simplification can not a plus b tan x laya a n multiplied kana then you will get a square plus a b tan x minus a square minus b square upon a plus b tan x okay plus a square minus a square get cancelled take b as a common then in bracket you will get b in bracket a tan x minus b upon a plus b tan x b tan y and hence again this b b get cancelled yeah don't side sa b b kana the cut on therefore y is equals to tan inverse of okay divide numerator and denominator by it a n upon divide karna then you will get tan inverse of okay tan inverse of tan of x minus b upon a it upon numerator la denominator la yeah do terms la a n divide kare la here you will get 1 plus b upon a tan x that is the tan inverse of in bracket tan x minus b upon a upon 1 plus b upon a tan x and this is the expansion of tan inverse of tan x minus tan inverse of b upon a. Now, tan inverse of tan x means what x and tan inverse of b upon a as it is. Now, differentiate this with respect to x, derivative of x is 1 and this divide by dx is equals to 1 and therefore the option b is a correct one here. Now, the next question. If y is equals to cosec inverse of in bracket root of 13 upon 2x plus 3 in root of 1 minus x square then dy by dx is equals to okay that is cosec inverse now we will convert this cosec in terms of the sign therefore i will write here y is equals to
sin inverse okay here is a 2x plus 3 in root of 1 minus x square upon root of 30 therefore y is equals to Sin inverse 2 upon root of 13 3 upon root of 13 1 minus x square. If you substitute x is equal to sin theta, therefore here you will get y is equal to x is equal to sin theta and next 2 upon root of 1330 subtract here cos of a and next 3 upon the root of 13 is equals to sine of a okay and therefore here you will get here y is equals to sin inverse of sin theta into cos of a plus cos theta into sin of a therefore y is equal to sin inverse of in bracket Sin of theta plus a that is equals to theta plus a. But what is the theta here? Theta is equals to that here. Theta is equals to sin inverse of x. Therefore, here y is equals to sin inverse of x plus a. Okay, and hence it's a derivative that is a dy by dx is equals to derivative of sine inverse of x is 1 upon in root of 1 minus x square. Okay, and this is the answer. <laughs> Therefore, the option D is the correct one. And yes, for a career, 25 questions. Yeah, take any poor material. I am as a South video. Zer to Mala, how video our last sale that to meet a like kara to me. I'm a share kara and is there some that to me a channel worthy now in a sun that to me initiates tell us subscribe kara maja channel worthy at with a bar of jay garita che video as that yanantar puna video which a video with a copper in the mustache.